buddy. Well, Memorial Day weekend has pretty much come and gone. Look what me and Jody did today. He got his server going, and I'm driving the uh, white, yellow, red, and orange car. He's driving the beautiful blue one with the white stripes. And since I didn't have the replay of this online experience together, he did. And he sent it to me, and here it is. You won't hear our commentary, but you'll be able, I'll be able to look it out from my, my car, or probably Jody's for that matter. <clears throat> like that Hearst shifter. There he is. We're on the updated desert route, of course. There goes the UFO, which we couldn't see in the game. Well, it's here in the, in the rerun. There's Jody. He's a good driver too, man. He really is. With a 360 controller, he's as good as I am with this G27, no problem. Now, we weren't racing. The main goal we had in this thing, guys, was to survive all the way to the end and come back in one piece but not knowing the stipulations that are uh, online only type of deals, well, we did the best we could. Now let's see if I could be in Jody's car if I choose to be. Yeah, it looks like I could. Yeah, I'm Jody. Check it out. Yeah, he's got the Shelby Snake sign. I've got glory over the kitties. Looks like he could have shifted a couple more times by now. looked with my uh, track IR hat on, my, it makes my guy look that way, so that's why he looked away and going to look at us. See, I'm in a lower gear. Look at them titties. Oh, she's a beautiful woman. Height body paid her for free. I'd never be the same. I'd be hooked again and lost in the sauce. Oh, I gotta leave well enough alone, but man, what a pretty face. Screaming glass cutters, too. Never do windows at my house, scratch the piss out of the glass. Man, man, you get one of those in the eye. So cool. No grounds for complaint. Notice my tank is way full. See, we're just scooting along nice. It does get a little bit spirited from time to time, but not, not really. It's more it just visiting back and forth and enjoying the camaraderie. It was so nice of Jody to spend time with me today on Memorial Day. I didn't even get another phone call. But that's okay too, because you know I get busy doing things, and I don't. At my age, I get used to this. Not to worry. I, I'm not lonely, and but I'll tell you what, that took a little bit of steam right out of it. Never had a chance to get lonely. I had fun with Jody today.
driving around on the track and trying to get things working. And hey, we got um, AI uh, cars in both directions on on a desert track now. The only pisser is they don't work in replays. Oh, man. See, we weren't really trying to go that fast. I'll tell you how fast we were going with a cheater. 148. We were just loafing. But I had made some changes to the track, and I wanted to show Jody. Well, he saw him. We had to have exactly the same track. Uh, updated exactly the same did you see the horse just got white that was pretty bizarre i wonder if i hit, I hit the lights by accident or i don't know what happened but i saw the horse go white where's the old boy he must be back there monkey but as you can see just loafing along enjoy look at the sky I mean, my goodness this is a nice part about replays you can just Put your hands together and uh, don't have to drive, don't have to wonder about going off the road. I will be showing you some uh, footage of the AI traffic going in both directions and you can have as many as you want. I'll tell you, from sparse to uh, rush hour traffic and whoo, it's talk about a mini game of trying to see how many cars you can pass without having a head-on collision. I wouldn't want to pull that crap in real life. You'd probably only make one mistake and you'd slaughter the whole family and plus yourself. Well, that's totally out of the question. I know some of the trees are flying a little bit, but they were designed for a different course than this one. Now, here's, I think we pull into the uh, trees on this one, but I'm not for sure. I mean, to the little place on the left. Maybe we do, maybe we don't. Well, I guess not on this one because the last time we did it, it kicked us back to the original spot, thought we were cheating. But Jody wondered if there would be uh, balloons and, and, well, that plane is low. Look at that sucker. He must have landed in the grass. I never saw that before. That was cool. Take a look at that white mountain. Looks like people have been skiing down the side of it. I know, guys, I know. How many times have we got to see this friggin' track? Well, you don't, don't watch if you don't want to. I don't, you know, do your best. But it's a, it's a great track to drive once you get the hang of it. It really feels like you're going somewhere because it's so big. And it's not constantly turn right. Turn left, turn right, turn left, turn right, turn left, turn left, turn right, turn right, turn left. It's, that, that shit gets annoying. I want to feel like I'm actually scooting down the road doing something. And this allows you to feel that way because of the long draw distances. Look, that mountain's still there. We're still scooting along. And, uh, and having an awful good time on it too. But Jody's fun to talk to. I, we use the cell phones. You know, I put it on the desk next to me and I turn the sound of the car way down low. Uh, like it is now, you can hardly hear it. I can bump it up a little bit. But I think I got the audio adjusted this time, so you should be able to hear my voice way over the top of the engines. What a beautiful car, isn't it? Oh, they designed a nice, nice Mustang. Nice Mustang. I drove a California Classic two summers ago. Oh, the thing was fucking gorgeous. What a sound. Oh, you have to, you'd have to strangle yourself not to put your foot into the gas a lot because it sounded so good.
a pretty car, isn't it? The blue. I know they are not supposed to have a wing where I put it, but if you'll notice looking out my back uh, mirror, the center mirror, you can see them out the glass. If you don't put the wing in the right spot, it blocks your vision. And I think set where it is, let me try camera five on this one. If you take a look at it, the wind coming up over here, it would be forced to go down and then really kick off the back. Toom, just like that. It's gonna catch it in here. It's gonna funnel it right off of the back and hold that car down. And of course the front air dam is gonna do a good job. What a, what a car, huh? What a car. And the tires and the wheels. I added those. I thought that really made a difference. Now they're identical cars, but the blue one looks smaller. Optical illusion. Now what brings them up to the uh, shaders patch standards is the extension folders. And that's what allows you to have many, 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 many things. But the flames and the uh, smoke are one of them for sure. I could have had flames and smoke before that, but you can't have, they don't work the same as they did before. So they have to be redone. They will use the locations of the flames, but you won't get anything decent unless you do it with an extension folder. What a brutal sounding bugger, isn't it? Three sixty controller. These holds his line perfect. I I realized today, if you do this good with a three sixty controller. You might find more immersion with a wheel, but I don't think you're going to drive any better than you already do. Now again, we're not going balls to the walls racing. We're not trying to see who's to anything. We're camaraderie and visiting. Thank Uncle M for the Hearst shifter. Either him or Donnie here, or both. I miss those two guys. They made some wonderful, wonderful, wonderful cars. And they built them right. They did a great job. I don't like to see the community get smaller. There's a ton of people out there that I just have never had a chance to meet or talk to or have any kind of a, a friendship with, but they're out there. They're doing amazing, phenomenal work. Now notice the door handles are chrome. I don't need to tell you how much of a job that was. Now notice the green is uh, dissipated. We're into the uh, tan color, the almost sandy tan. Now Jody was telling me that he didn't see any skid marks on the road at all. Somehow that that's uh, kept in the mind of my computer what was where the skid marks were days ago. And it remembered them. 
So Jody, when he sees this video back of our footage, um, he'll say, oh my God, there was skid marks on your machine. Now let's go back to Jody's view for a minute, just to make sure that that's the case. There we are. Now we'll look and see if there's skid marks from time to time. Looks like he's been, yeah, I saw some there. Looks like he's being followed by a shark. I found that there was an error with the mesh not meeting correctly. And it was a huge mistake. If you were going cross country, you would have seen that going, what the hell's going on here? Just like I did. So that huge mountain that you're seeing right in front of us now had to be placed there where the two pieces of mesh met to completely cover up that mistake. I know ban both bandages on bullet holes, but band-aids, but nevertheless, Now, the interesting thing from Jody's view, I'm not seeing skid marks much. We'll go a little bit farther and see if uh, we see any. What a delightful car this is. And this isn't the new one that was put out by Sir Spatz. That's a 2019, this is a 2018. And that one's got some real bells and whistles. I'll tell you, that is an amazing car. No downside to it that I, I don't look for them, but I didn't find any either. All right, I'm not seeing any skid marks. Let's go back to my view and see if I see any. You know something? I think I can tell the difference between PP filters. From his car, it looks a little different than from my car. Notice how warm the textures look right now? Let's jump back over there and see. Yeah, they are different. Watch. Well, I don't know if they are or they're not. I can't tell. That skin I did just for the NASCAR. I didn't realize it was NAS, not NAZ, but well, what are you gonna do from a knucklehead? Now what we're gonna start doing up ahead now is just looking at the signs of the windows and the names of things have a few chuckles. Now there's some skid marks. One thing I want to change here is Stavis's Diner. I want it to be the, the police officer's donut shop. So, uh, wow, look at that thing smoking. That was different. Hope he didn't blow the engine over to his car and see what's going on. He's looking at Stavis. Oh, I know what he was doing. He had to go into the uh, menu on the far right and get this in building inspector so he can look and see the name of, of Stavis's diner and come to find out the real name of it on the side of the thing as far as files is called. Um, one wall 27 underscore sub zero. So that's how I can find out where the name, where that actually is. In other words, get the, the PNG of it so I can change the name. Right now, it's just it's just those numbers or names that, with no picture, I never could find it. But that's where we are for right this minute. Um, get out for a camera five. Kuwait. 
Man, I think those rims do a lot for the car, though. I really do. There, I think of all the rims, because they're paintable on the inside, you can make them whatever color you want with the uh, showroom. And, boy, I really enjoy that. And if you'll notice, the Shelby Super Snake in this is also chrome. I'm pretty sure this back piece, yep, the back piece is, and maybe the front piece as well. Yes, it is. But the little side ones are are not. See the difference between the texture? Shelby Super Snake. They'd be nice in gold, don't you think? Nice gold ones? Yeah, that'd be, I, that's an idea. Let's go to the other car, which they should be the same except Yeah, that would look. Oh, look at this! Look at the carbon fiber under the black on the black. Same as this. Same as around here, carbon fiber. Snatchco. I don't know how much this will catch of us. Oh, boy, I sure do wish we could have the uh, AI flood traffic and replays at the same time. That would be cool. Now one thing about this particular part of the track, take a look at what happens when Jody tries to cross that little tiny, uh, you can't do it. It's it's real pisser trying to cross that. It's a crosswalk, but it's it raises hell with anything that's the normal car. Single Racers Academy. Squonky wanted to share a building with him because we don't need an awful lot of space. Now, if it was the right time of day, you'd be able to read that nicely, but you can't right now. And I was talking to Jody about the wheels on that truck uh, being octagon shaped instead of round. God bless you, Michael. China's Big Cock Outlet Store. That's amazing how that just does that. Now, before we leave here, I want to take you over and show you that I finally got the uh, name of the church on there right. It was had to be backwards and upside down in order to be right in here. If you can figure that out, you're a better man than I am. Oh, that thing just lays rubber. See, I don't do hardly ever online with a subtle course of it's problematic as hell. I mean, it's, everything has got to be 100% immaculately clean. Exactly the same or it doesn't happen. But we'll take a ride across the street before we leave. And we're not going to be much longer, guys. I know it's just like watching home movies. But finally, we got Believer's Covenant Church, chapel. And I wanted real stained glass, you know. I think you should have that. You don't see light coming through it like I would like to, but I might be able to do something about that. I got a John
Yep. Believers Covenant Church Chapel. I had to mix and match a little bit because some of this is a little risque. I mean, if you look at this one, you got Squawky biting her in the ass and it says blowjobs and knobbers, 50 cents inquire within. Don't blame Squawk, you want to bite that booty. Man, I'd put a tooth to that sucker myself, I think, if I was younger. I, from what I remember, it used to be a hell of a lot of fun, but you can't prove it by me anymore. I truly have forgotten what it's all about. Now guys, mainly the reason I'm putting this up there is so Jody can see the rerun. I know it's not going to be something that everybody's going to want to see. But it does give you a chance to get a little bit of a tour of this part of the track. I'd like to tell you we made it all the way around, but as you can see pretty quick, this is going to end unexpectedly. Not knowing the rules of online. I'm so used to be able to drive wherever I want to without a penalty. The blue car does look, look smaller, doesn't it? And they're identical cars. The only thing that's different is the paint job. I was telling Jody, if you want to now, you can go out on the pier and see the sailboats up close. He was, he was a little nervous at first, but they took my word for it. Actually, he went the other day on his own. He said I was a little scared, humble, to be honest. But you were right. There was no harm came to me. Believe it or not, the other day I was down there with a car, and I did a donut on there. I, I thought I had to be out of my friggin' tree. Go in the ocean real easy. Now I know it seems like we're going slow, but the map is so big that even at 100 miles an hour, it seems like you're barely crawling. I think that'd be a great place uh, to have the wing, to be honest with you. pretty bumpy so you got to be careful that you don't catch the bottom of the car on some of it. Look at this one. Beautiful suspension on this car though. Absolutely. It's a gorgeous vehicle. I think it really was a Kuno's car that everybody's grabbed and has had fun re-whittling on. Which God bless them. Have at it man because if you start out with something quality. You're, if you don't hose the piss out of it you're going to end up with something quality. Now don't fault me for the textures on these sailboats, that's how they came. Yeah, you can see skid marks. See, there's where I did the circle. Oops. Yeah, see it? It's not really a very good one, but...
Y'all see the sand over there? That's where part of the beach is. It's a huge, huge map. Well worthy of taking one of those uh, Paris to Dakar trucks and to just go along and see it. It's, it's got a lot to show you. I could add more and I could keep adding more, but the trouble is there's been so many updates in the last week, it, it's really getting nerve wracking to keep track of what one does what. So I have to peel some of these off of uh, Mediafire. It's getting to be too many of them and just save the very last one. So should you have any problems with a download, contact me and I'll make sure you're straightened out. Now normally we would just go straight, but I wanted to show them that we could go all the way out to the ocean. Uh, but you can't do that. Plan online. There you are. It instantly puts you back here. Isn't that a pisser? If I'm not mistaken, I think that's, well, it's pretty much the end of it. it looks like we might have done a little more. 37 minutes and 28 for the whole thing. Oh, there's a new Ferrari F40 out, and the guy's animations on the driver are so absolutely amazing. He uses the clutch. He rolls up and down the windows with a crank handle. The guy shifts flawlessly, gasses it, brakes it, uh, reaches over and gets different uh, buttons to make headlights on and off. It's just totally out of the top yep, just amazing I'll see if I can find oh, I'm sure I can the um, link to that that mod and uh, boy support this guy absolutely amazing fellow absolutely outstanding absolutely F40 lover or I think his name I if I screwed that up forgive me I, bad enough on names it is when I know what the hell I'm talking about but when I don't it's got it, the chances are getting slimmer all the time yeah, I could see rubber out here. I had some fun. Now, what we weren't seeing online, and we didn't see any of the balloons, and we didn't see, uh, th I think we might have seen the, the airplane, but it was sparse. Well, I don't think it ever gets much better than this guy, so I'm gonna call it a day right here. I hope you have had a good weekend. And be sure to um, say hi to me in the comments if you get a chance, okay? God bless you, Jody. Thank you for a wonderful Memorial Day. I really do appreciate the time we spent. Bye-bye now. <laughs>